The competitive race in Livonia for city council. One person appears to be taking matters into their own hands to try to weed out the candidates. Right, but as our Coco McAvoy shows us, the culprit's plan isn't working because it was all caught on camera. All across the city of Livonia, we're seeing yard signs for city races, but one local man who's running for city council started to see his yard signs disappear. And you start to scratch your head, where'd my lawn sign go? One after another, Rob Donovic's city council campaign signs vanished along Plymouth Road in Livonia. But after nine or ten go missing, you know that there's something going on behind the scenes. And Donovic was in for a big surprise. Right there. There he is, loads up and takes off. He went to his friend Tarek Shami's gas station. My friend Terry was nice, nice enough to let me look at his cameras and we found the sticky finger bandit. On a mission in the middle of the night. We saw someone running through the parking lot, grab my lawn sign, throw it in their vehicle and take off with them. All captured on camera. People's got to be careful what they're doing these days because we can catch them. Donovic gathered more campaign signs today, hoping to keep his name out there in a tight race with several viable candidates in the city. Uh, all the candidates have been very friendly. We've been working hard together to represent Livonia. He doesn't want to press charges against the sticky finger bandit. He just wants his expensive signs back. Let's move on and you know, get back to the issues that matter to Livonia voters. In Livonia. I said, I just want to kind of forgive and forget. I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4. And one of the other candidates running for city council, Brandon McCullough, reached out to us saying he's also had some of his campaign signs stolen. So if you know who's responsible, call police.